Okay, let's see if I can summarize everything in less than 3 minutes. So I was catching up on some Film Riot episodes and I see Ryan announcing that My World Real Competition is back. I wrote Bleeding Heart, showed it to my director friend Xian Yip and I asked him to be my AD and editor. Then I already knew who had to be my DOP, Mi Hai Son. Everyone who's read my script asked me, Linda, how are you going to make that heart? Are you going to use papier mache or are you going to use a real cow's heart? real cow's heart? No, I don't think so. Luckily, I found these anti-stress balls. It just needed some paint and a little, a little bit of blood inside. A little, a little bit more. Then, I realized I need a sound person. I own a Rode mic. This Rode video mic. So I usually am the boom operator on sets. I'm so grateful that Ambrose said yes to help me on set and for post. Then, I asked Simon to be a master in camera, Nancy for the clapper, my good friend Maggie to be script supervisor, and Brian for this behind the scenes footage. Not long later, Mihai goes, Linda, let's use the Sony FS7. Philip Bloom just posted a review on it. Shooting an S-Log3 super flat image and then you get all the leeway to color grade afterwards is amazing. It's almost like shooting raw. It's like the next best thing. My next thought was, I need a very good makeup artist, and here comes Mihai to the rescue. I found my talented actors Luba and Big Bong by doing casting call on local Montreal Facebook groups. Doing audition tapes saved me a lot of times because I wasn't available for actual auditions. Since my short film is basically just one scene, we shot everything in one morning, five hours at the Montreal Improv Theatre. They kindly made sure nobody would disturb us while we filmed so we have good sound. We met very early and had all the right setup, makeup and costume done. Then we started at 9 o'clock sharp. We actually worked very very well and we're so efficient that we had time to add two more shots. I don't know how, but the next day we already had a rough cut. Now this is the first time I worked with an editor. It's really weird because the whole time in the editing room I was trying to grab the mouse and edit it myself, even if I knew Ziyang is a better editor than I am. Once we were satisfied with the final cut, Umberto comes to do the sound mixing and he recommends me to do some dubbing. I was reluctant to do so because I know it can take a while for actors to get it right, but Luba is so amazing she got at the third take. So that kind of sums up the whole production process. Once again, I learned a lot on this shoot. Hope you guys enjoyed my short film Bleeding Heart and this behind the scenes video.